that experiment's dangerous. That may be, but this is something I want to do. Something I must do. Please, try to understand. Ten days from now, by then, the experiment should yield fruit. I will be able to show you the homunculus. At last, science will prove itself capable of creating life. How I wish she could have been here, Helena. That is my only regret. See you in ten days, then. Oh, one more thing. Could you keep this a secret from Hugo and Margaret? And knowing Hugo, if he learns of this, he might do something like attempt to bring Elena back from the dead. He can't seem to face his mother's death. Should this experiment succeed, if I manage to find what answers I can in my quest for truth, I shall commit all records of my research to the fire. Now, take care. Hey, did you manage to see Father? Uh-huh. What is it? Damn, what's the matter with Father anyway? He hasn't let me into his laboratory lately. When I went in there the other day, he got really angry with me. And ever since, there's some secret in there he can't tell me about. I just know it. Hey. Are you like Father's right-hand man? You know, with tools from the future and stuff? Of course not. Nothing like that. Really? I'd definitely ask for your help if I were Father. Then I could make a machine to move through time, like the one you showed me before. I sort of understand how it works anyway. Wow, really? Well, I'm impressed. Well, I said sort of. Anyway, I'm more interested in what Father's working on right now. Hugo, I'm sure Father will tell us one of these days. I don't know about that. Children, I have something to tell you. Father? I'm going to start another experiment, but this one will be very dangerous. So I want you two to leave the house for a while. Right away? The sooner the better. I'll send word in about 10 days. Go to our relatives' homes or anywhere else you like. That's all. Can I help with the experiment? No. Both of you have to leave this house. Oh, for Pete's sake, what does he think he's doing, huh? Come on, where should we go? Sis? So, you're just going to do it? Do we have a choice? But, but... It's only for a little while. Let's go, we have to get ready. I guess I'll be going now. Of course. I am sorry we're always in the middle of something. See you soon, okay?
Is anybody here? Anybody? Dr. Wagner, Margaret, Hugo. Anyone there? Hugo. The basement? This meter here, is this a time machine? That can't be. But that sounded like Margaret's voice just now. How do you know my number? Oh, that. I asked someone called Eckert. You know, you mentioned it once. How did you get here, and why? Were you the one threatening Mr. Eckert? Come on, threaten sounds so serious. All I did was propose a deal. Can I help it if he jumped at the chance when I told him what he wanted to hear about his daughter? Oh, and about how I got here. It's pretty simple, really. Remember that tool you showed me? I just made one of my own, you see? What? Well, actually, I didn't make it, not exactly. The Hugo of the future completed it and gave it to me. A transport mechanism to time-space marked by a phenomena of relevance. You like it? Just like yours. Actually, I think the other stuff may be different, but... Who cares, right? In any case, I can track and follow your machine. What about Margaret? Will you look at that? I'm forgetting the point of the whole thing. Can you drop by? I'll be waiting at the square. Bring homunculus. We have a few things to discuss. Oh, and by the way, do what I tell you, okay? Otherwise, someone you care about is going to die. I don't have to tell you what I mean about that, right? Later, then. Hugo! Hey! 